As you might have noticed, most websites don't have a download button for their videos. So let's see how we can download them anyway. We're going to explore two of the most common cases you will find on most websites. So as you can see, there is no download options. So what you want to do is hit F12 on your keyboard to open the page source code. Now we need to find the video here in the source code. To do that, we click on this icon on the top left and then we click on the videos or anyway on the elements over the video. There are usually many elements over the video we want to download. So after we click the closer elements, then we need to keep expanding the code until we reach the actual video, which is going to look something like this. So there is a, a video element with a link inside, something that starts with HTTPS and has some .mp4 somewhere in the link. So what you want to do is right click on the link, not in the element like I did, but on the link and then click on open a new tab. From here, you just need to click the three dots on the bottom right and hit download. And that's it. The second case is the blob video. The one you'll probably find the most on the internet. So we start as before, hitting F12 to show the page source code. And again, we click on the icon on the top left and we click on the video. Now, again, we need to find the link to the video here in the source code. It might not be exactly where you clicked, but probably a little bit down. As you can see here, the link is a blob. If you try to open this one, as we did before, it doesn't work. So what you need to do now is to go on the network tab. And in the search button, you type this M3U8, and then you can refresh the page. After that, you will find a couple of entries in the list. So you got to try your luck. You start with the first one from the headers. And what you want to do is to copy the request URL, all of it from HTTPS to the end. Now you want to head to VLC Media Player, click Media, Convert Save, Network, and paste the link you just copied. Now click Convert. On the Option tab, click on the Wrench. And for the Video Codec tab, select Keep Original Track, as here and you want to do the same for the audio. Subtitle, we don't really care about this one. Once you're done, you click save, you choose a destination where you want to save your videos. In this case, I create a, a folder and then click save. After that, you just wait some time for the video to download. And when you're done with downloading, you should find your video in the folder you choose. There are other websites that use different methods of encryption for their videos, something like Prime Videos, Netflix, Disney Plus. So the only real way there is probably to register your screen with OBS, but you probably shouldn't because that's probably piracy. So yeah, stick to the MP4 and blob video. See you next time.